Is this you? Wow! I bet if God wore pants, he'd have a belt like that. Hey, Simpson! Wanna trade belts? Well, not really, because yours is just a piece of extension cord. Hey, dude, he's ragging on your cord. Get him! Okay, maybe you're a bit better off than our friend Jimbo here, and you're not using a piece of extension cord as a belt. But if you're looking for a new belt and a piece of tech wear, this could be for you. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm a big fan of leather goods, and I think everyone should have a good, well-made leather belt as part of their wardrobe. But if what you're looking for is something a bit more lightweight and comfortable, well, this stealth belt by Alpaca has been fulfilling that role for me. Full transparency, this belt was sent to me to review, but I am not receiving any payment for this video, and I am an affiliate. So, what do we got? This belt here is made from high strength polyester webbing that according to the website can hold up to 100 kilograms of force. That's about 220 pounds in freedom units. And when you do give it a good pull, it does feel quite strong. But as you can see, it's also stretchy. So what does that mean? Well, stretch means comfort. And unlike a leather belt, there is give when you wear this one, which means if you're on your fourth plate at your local all you can eat Chinese buffet, you won't need to covertly loosen your belt under the table. That's why this belt is called the Stealth Belt. It allows you to overeat and be fat stealthily. <laughs> no, just kidding. But it is comfortable. I've also been using this belt for months, so this is definitely a long-term opinion. In my personal experience, this belt is sturdy enough to hold up my pants, but still stretchy and thin enough to remain lightweight and comfy. This, however, may not work for everyone because if you're like this guy, or you tend to carry any sort of tools on your belt with any sort of holster, the stretchiness may not work for you if you need that added support. For example, when you go to grab a tool from your holster or pouch, that stretch may prevent you from removing said tool as the belt stretches. This does depend on the kind of tool and pouch though. As you can see, it's fine for my Leatherman Paracord pouch here. But for this leather EDC organizer by Paradrop Leather, it's a bit of an issue. This belt is fully adjustable, of course, comes in a few sizes, but I haven't gotten to the coolest part, and it's this. This is what I love the most about this belt, the magnetic fidlock clasp. So unlike a traditional belt with the sizing holes and the belt tongue, yes, apparently it's called a tongue, that goes into the holes, sorry, <laughs> This belt uses a magnetic fidlock to open and close the belt, which makes taking it on and off super fast and actually really satisfying. To disengage, you just pull up on the pull tab, and to close the belt, you literally place the buckle together and it will auto-magically clasp. Kind of feel like Batman when I put it on. And when closed, it is super secure, and it will not come apart accidentally unless you pull up on the opening tab. I also love the minimalist and techy vibes of this belt just by the way it looks. So I've talked about what I do like, but what's there not to like? Well, not much, but I do have one issue. When putting the belt on, you have to feed it through the belt loops of your pants. And of course, due to the sizing and the corner formed by this material here, the belt can get caught on your belt loops when you're feeding it through. It doesn't always happen, nor is it a huge issue, but it does get caught once in a while when putting the belt on or taking it off. This could be remedied by reducing the width of the material or perhaps making the transition of this corner a bit more angled so that the belt loops don't get caught. So other than that, I do like it. If you want to get one for yourself, I've got a link in the description and don't forget to use my discount code.